With the news coming out from Lumion 2023 that's going to be available in the beginning of next year, Lumion subscription is here as well. So let's see what this is all about. My name is Katarina Magarnzana and I'll see you next. Welcome to another video from Garden Design Tools and today's video it's all about Lumion subscription. What does this mean for Lumion users? So imagine I'm just going to give you my uh, context. So I have already Lumion 12.5 uh, Pro and I'm going to keep up with the updates. What this means now is that for me to keep up with the updates I'll have to subscribe to Lumion subscription method. So right now you have subscription and you have the normal perpetual licensing. So if you're just getting into Lumion, you'll just buy the license, Lumion Pro, uh, and that's 3000 euros plus tax. Okay, I'm just going to give you the example of Lumion Pro. I'm not going to really just talk about the license one, the standard one, sorry. If you're like me you and you really want to keep the updates every year, you have the entry fee that you've paid when you start using Lumion, maybe 3000, maybe a bit less at a time. Plus every year you do, it will cost you probably around almost 1000 euro plus tax every year to keep up with the program updates. Right now you have to subscribe to the uh, subscription method one year or three years already if you want to just pay for the next three years what this means is that you for now they're doing a promotion so i paid 700 and something plus tax so slightly less in my previous years but in the next years it's going to be 1500 every year so it's going to go from up from 1000 that i will normally pay to keep up with the updates to the 1500 what this means is more updates okay they're going to have more frequent updates they have this redone engine already that's coming up so with that redone engine the, the, the updates are going to be more frequently so i'm expect uh, speculating that that's the reason why they put the price up as well um so you know it's it was always for me it was always already a subscription method because i'll do the updates anyway if you like me, you had the license, perpetual license before. Imagine that uh, in two years uh, you want to start paying the updates, you go back to the late, last perpetual license. So you go back to 12.5. If you're just getting into Lumion now and you just pay for the subscription method, so you don't actually have any perpetual license, you just have uh, a subscription, I think the program will finish once you not paying it um i'm not sure exactly um i haven't you know uh, seen anything about that but imagine that you're just subscribing to lumion and you stop paying it i think you the problem stop working uh but you know this is lumion is not a, a cheap program but now it's slightly better if you were just thinking in getting it to lumion because instead of you know paying the three thousand you're gonna have an entry fee that's just 1500 but that's going to be every year um so it was never a cheap option or a, a cheap uh, um, program to start with but you know i think if it's for the sustainability of the company plus for the amazing updates that hopefully they will deliver uh so you know i'm all up for it because i think it's it's pretty cool um so let's just compare here the facts of one year let's just uh, see a little bit about the licensing um, uh, how does it work so basically you have the one year like i said and the three years um you pay the initial fee automatically benefit from all the product updates um when you buy the initial fees actually the subscription um um this means faster early access to the new features and content as soon as they release uh, and a, a smoother upgrade experience so the, the the actual updates are going to be much easier so you're not, not going to have to reinstall the program so with the, the redone of the uh, rendering engine um, all these updates are going to be much much easier so access to lumion 2023 more accessible than ever so i'm going to link instead of just reading here um i'm gonna link uh for this uh blog post they have about not the blog post their page actually about the subscriptions um 
like I said, I think it's cool. I think, you know, I just want to, to, for them to, to, to keep up with the updates and always improving because that's really important for me and for all the users, of course, to have a really quality program and that the software uh, keeps going. I was hoping that one of the news, and we'll have to wait for next, the beginning of next year, is going to be their uh, VR um, um, options. Uh, so hopefully uh, they will improve their ends as well. So, you know, let me know what you think. I'll link everything uh, below. Uh, yeah, so if you like me, you paid already um, 1000 euros every year for the update next year you're gonna pay 1500 so let me know what you think let me know if you think it's too much if not let me know see you guys in the next one